Well, for decades, Chicago's public libraries have served a key role for families in many neighborhoods. Yeah, and the end of the pandemic will create new opportunities as things slowly get back to normal here. The library's new commissioner, Chris Brown, is joining us now to talk about what comes next. So nice to see you. Hello to you. Hey, Lourdes. Hey, Ben. Good to, good to be on with you. All right. So a lot of businesses and organizations have been planning over the last year for life after the pandemic. And I'm wondering what it means for Chicago Public Libraries. What are you guys going to be doing? Well, right now we're really in the thick of our, our summer learning program. We're getting geared up for that. We have all kinds of exciting opportunities for our youth. And the whole summer is going to be involved in art making and uh, we're really so excited for our youth. Um, we have our signature U Media spaces that really cater to a lot of our, our teens all throughout Chicago, and those have now opened up this week. So we're so excited to be opening back up along with the rest of the city. The libraries are about so much more than books. Talk a little bit about these new media spaces you have and who do they appeal to? Yeah, they're really for our teens to, to get involved in developing those 21st century skills. So they're able to come in and, and work with our staff and learn and learn how to do digital art. And a lot of them have gone on to be some of Chicago's most notable MCs like Chance and No Name. Wow, and I know that during the pandemic you had to roll back on some of the hours, capacity was restricted. Some of that, it's my understanding, it's lifted as of today. So is that is that the case or are there still some restrictions in place? What will people find when they open the doors there? Well, they'll still they'll still find our buildings open to them. Uh, our U Media space is open. Uh, we're, we're keeping our our public and our staff safe as well. Um, and you know, we we haven't brought back all of our in person events yet. But I know you were both uh, guests on our live from the mm -hmm. library program, and just want to thank you both so much. Uh, we do thousands of early literacy events every year, and we're so fortunate we were able to pivot and move those online and just meet those early literacy yeah. needs for Chicagoans all throughout the city. Chris, the pandemic changed you know, work for so much of us. I would imagine there are some lessons uh, that libraries learned during the pandemic about how to reach people who actually couldn't come into their buildings, uh, lessons that will stick around for many years to come. Can you share any of those? Uh, anything good to come from the pandemic, I guess is what I'm asking. Well, well definitely with Live from the Library, I think we, we really developed this platform for civic engagement with our Chicago notables, and there's, there's so many of them. And you all really helped model early literacy for this city. And I think that's one development that's gonna stick around. And we have such, such strong philanthropic supporters like the Chicago Public Library Foundation. So we'll be working closely with them on our, our future innovations. All right, Chris Brown, the new commissioner there for Chicago Public Libraries. We appreciate your time and good luck to you. Oh, thanks so much for having me. All Thank right, you. excited to visit. Thank you.